Cameron for Tweak Town here. I'm here at uh, lunch at Piero's and I'm here with Stu from Via Technology and uh, they've got uh, a new dual core processor out so we're going to focus on that. So Stu, over to you. Okay. Well yeah, this is the very first time in public that we've shown off our new dual core nano solution, the Via Nano X2 processor. And we've got a demo here. Of, uh, this is a mini ITX pre-production board. It's paired with the VX900, which has, as you can see, really good hardware acceleration for this HD video. This is 720p, uh, H.264, and you can see the CPU is not really... The really usage is at around uh, 3 to 4%. Yeah. yeah. On both the cores, you can see both the cores there. The new uh, X2 is based on, here it is, and it's based on a, six, uh, a 40 nanometer process. So in terms of uh, TDP, energy usage and power consumption, it's similar to the single core variant but um, obviously with double the core count, so vastly improved multitasking and overall performance. All right, now, Stu, over here, you've got a system set up. Um, what's, uh, any, any specific details about the system you want to tell it's us about? It's a mini ITX board. Uh, it's a pre-production sample. We're hoping to have this, uh, the, the full, or if you like, the, the official mini ITX board with this chip will be the uh, M900. That should be out in the next month or so. Okay, so um, consumers, we also consumers will be able to pick up a system like this in around a month or so. And uh, it, I wouldn't say that it will be in store shelves within a month or so, but it's sampling to our customers right now. So with any luck, we'll, uh, our partners will be able to bring out systems and get them on store shelves, maybe certainly before the summer. Okay. It's aimed uh, primarily, I mean, this at this level, this is a 1.4 gigahertz. This would be for an entry-level all-in-one desktop or maybe small form factor desktop systems. But it also opens the door for us for the traditional notebook designs. Also, of course, uh, with the lower core speeds on their netbooks as well. And it's also a vital for our embedded industry partners who are increasingly interested in multi-core platforms. Okay. Thank you, Stu. Uh, so it's been Cameron at uh, Lunch at Pierre's with uh, uh, Stu from VIA looking at their new dual-core processor.